A long-distance runner, Moro Prosperi, took part in the 1994 Marathon of the Sands in Morocco, a six-day-long endurance race in one of the driest and most barren places in the world. During the race, an unexpected sandstorm devoured him. The brutal storm blinded Prosperi in the middle of the desert. He wound up disoriented and lost his way. One day after going off track, he found himself in an abandoned Muslim shrine in Algeria. He was alone in the desert. No food and no water. At sea, people can survive for six to seven days without water. However, in the desert, death occurs after about three days as the body dries out quickly. Drinking nothing for the first 24 hours put Prosperi's body into survival mode. He needed to figure something out. Although drinking urine is not recommended, as it contains salt and will actually dehydrate you further, there were not many choices left for Prosperity. He was forced to drink his own urine, lick dew off of rocks, and suck moisture out of his wet pipes. In order to survive, he also drank the blood of bats and ate their meat. Drinking the bat blood helped him a lot, as it was nutritious, easy to digest, and conserved his body's natural water. A few days later, assuming he would never be found, he slit his wrists with a penknife from his supplies. However, it was such dry heat that the wounds clotted and he decided to go back into the desert to find help. For nine days, he walked through the desert, eating insects and reptiles. Finally, he found a small village. His liver almost completely failed, and he lost 35 pounds during his ordeal in the desert. Nevertheless, he remained an enthusiastic runner and even returned and completed the race in 2012.